we're in the field today participating in a citizen science project where we're going to net monarch butterflies that are actually on their migration to their overwintering ground in Mexico and put tags on those butterflies so that we can better understand, monitor, and manage monarch butterfly migration. Today is a day in early September that's just a great monarch butterfly migration day. Depending on where you're located in the eastern part of the United States, monarch butterfly tagging could start in August, mid-August, or the 1st of September. Our tagging activities today are being conducted with our friends at Monarch Watch. I'm sure there's going to be people watching this video that are concerned about the tags harming the butterflies. You need to know that Monarch Watch has been tagging butterflies for 26 years, since 1992, and citizen scientists have now tagged over 1.5 million monarch butterflies, and the tags don't interfere with the flight or harm the butterflies. Tagging monarch butterflies is an important citizen science project because it tells us all kinds of things. Where the monarchs in Mexico originated from, the flow of the migration, the timing and the pace of the migration, mortality that occurs during the migration, and changes in geographic distribution of the butterflies. Whether your monarch butterfly was raised from an egg or a caterpillar, or it was wild caught, there's very specific information that we record for each monarch butterfly we tag. Two, three, three, nice female. The date, the location, the sex of the butterfly, and the tag number. These tags are then placed in a very specific location on the butterfly, not to hinder their flight. The tag is placed on the discal cell on the hind wing of the butterfly. Once the monarch is tagged and we've recorded all the appropriate information, it's released back into the wild to continue its migration to Mexico. Tagging kits range from 25 to 500 tags, and Monarch Watch ships them to you in August, just ahead of the migration. Once the migration season is completed for the year, please submit your data back to Monarch Watch by December 1st. Having the type of a project where we can conduct citizen science research on monarch butterfly migration and provide pollinator value, now that's great habitat.